Baines against Conley. Left side, Towns. And a nice intensity foul. from Towns in the paint. Doesn't back first, off first and foul. takes that first shot while being fouled. And he makes the first. This is as good as it gets from the charity strike here in the second. McDaniels, he's checked in for Prince. Kansas City leading by 17. There's the pass to Davison. Reynolds passes to Austin. Here's Davison. It's rebounded by Towns. Towns has got rebound number eight now on the night. But still, eventually you got to feel like he'll start knocking those down again. Now here's Towns. Conley for three. Good for his eighth field goal. He's attempted a dozen shots. Boy, they've been terrific from beyond here in the second. Passes it to Austin. Pass to Reynolds. Knocked loose. It's stolen by Edwards. Back to Conley. McDaniels with the ball. Pass to Towns. From seven. No good on the shot. And Kansas City will go the other way with it. Austin with it. Conley picks him up. Here's Davison. And it's McDaniels with the rebound. Timberwolves trail by 14. Now the pass to Conley. Oh, the lob to Gobert. And slam dunk by Gobert. Few players in the league do a better job of finding the open man than Mike Conley. Baines passes to Davison. Now Austin. Clock is at three. Pass to Reynolds. From down in the low post, it goes. And the Knights lead by 14. Unselfish. Moving the ball. Love to see this kind of offense. Poked away. Conley against Bean. The shot, no good. Kansas City leading by 14. And contact on the shot, so he'll be shooting free throws here. Second personal foul, first team foul. At the line for the away team, Baines taking two shots. First free throw is good. He's perfect from the line this time. We talk about players, Steve, we talk about coaches and GMs, but not too much about owners and their effect on the game and the organization. Kevin, the owners for me, are A1. It starts from the top. They're the ones who hire the team president, GMs, and coaches. And certainly, there's some teams who have some great owners. Here's Gobert. And that one oh, clearly a foul. Gets the whistle and two shots coming up. Gobert going to the line. The defense couldn't do anything but foul the big fella. You have to admire the energy with which Rudy Gobert attacks the glass. Kevin, well, his stats reflect that tremendous effort. He averages some crazy rebounding numbers, using not just his size, but also his expert timing. Rollins checked in for Kansas City. Here's Dawkins. Pass to Davison. Elbow shot is on the way. No good off the back of the rim. It's a shot you would think he would make, but he just doesn't make it all the time. Back to McDaniel. down low. Falls right in. He is 8 for 11 with that shot. And this is what you like to see. Big Cat using that size to his advantage. And Baines kicks to Austin. Here's Davison. McDaniels defending. 
the inside just a bit too congested for him to get the usual shot he would have with rhythm. And it's Towns penetrating. Field goal number nine. He's nine of 12 with that basket. Yeah, they're going to have a nice little run here. Pass to Austin. Here's Davison. And Kansas City misses again. He just doesn't look like himself this quarter. Something's missing. And it also shows you how difficult this game is. He's just a little bit off, but it can result in missing everything. Timberwolves trail by 11. Now, here's McDaniel. No good there, and that would have cut it to single digits. And so Kansas City now. It's stolen by Gobert. And it's Towns penetrating. And how about those long strides of Towns? Uses that length so well on these drives to attract contact. Oh, good on that. And the Timberwolves making a change here. Reed's checked in. And the second free throw, good. Kansas City leading by 10. Baines passes to Austin. Here's Davison. Here's Rollins. Defended by Towns. Down low. Here's Austin. Takes the Austin. assist and lays it in. Picked out the pass nicely. And that's just cold-blooded right there. He's taking no prisoners. Expanding upon this lead. Trying to close it out. He's really stepped up. Now here is Conley. Lock at six with the shot. Oh, and that one had the right spin on it, and it is good. Conley's got five points now in the quarter. And the pass to Davison. Here's Rollins. Takes it into the teeth of the D and converts the layup. Doesn't get exactly the screen he wants, but turns out he doesn't need it. Outside, Edwards. Passes it to Reed. No one near Conley as he lets it go. Makes no mistake on the open jump shot. And he is really in a zone right now, playing and scoring with confidence. I'm called here. Kansas City decides to talk it over. And coach is looking to seize every advantage, maximize every possession. Critical part of the game. You have to be flexible. You have to be able to adjust what you're doing. player of the game and Kevin it, it's a no-brainer he's controlled every aspect of this game and it's just so fun to see a player perform at a level that's just higher than anyone else out on the floor and as the star of this team he knows he's going to be the object of the crowd's anger and now we've got some time to check in from the sidelines you got for us DA well guys I listened in on what the head coach of the Knights told his team his point to them was that they put themselves in a position to succeed and that this is their game to lose. So he needs to see full concentration out of every guy on the court to finish this one off. Kevin? Thank you, David. Get a photo ball. Timberwolves trail by 10. Conley scanning the floor inside. down low, covered by Rollins, and Towns gets it to go. Towns has got 11 points in the quarter. Baines against Conley. Baines passes to Dawkins. Whistle blows, but that's going to be a travel. Minnesota calls timeouts. Call timeout. All right, 
stand. Let me hear you give it up for your Timberwolves Dancer. Here is Edwards. Conley finds Towns. Two minutes remaining in the game. The shot's good. Towns has got 15 points here in the second half. And one of the offensive forces in the league. When Towns wants to score, it is really hard to keep him from his spots. Now here's Austin. He's fouled pretty hard on that shot, but he's got the chance to pick up the points at the line. It's on Anthony Edwards. At the line for the away team, Austin, two shots. He drops the first one, and that makes it a seven-point lead. Second one is good. They both at the line, and it's an eight-point game. Timberwolves on offense. Outside Conley. Pass to Towns. Rebounded by Kansas City. Rollins got four rebounds now tonight. Baines bounce pass. Conley against Dawkins. Back to Baines. Nice ball movement by Kansas City. Shot clock at six. And the call on the shot that sends him to the line. Michael Conley picks one up. He hits the first one, and that will put them up by nine. At the line for two. And that's good as he hits both of his shots. We've got 108 left in the fourth quarter. Pass to Towns. And that one falls coming off Conley's feet. Possessing the touch from there. I like when Towns shows off that smooth mid-range game. Here's the pass to Austin. Here's Davison. Here's Rollins. Passes it to Davison. Four on the shot clock. Timberwolves foul. Carl Anthony Towns. First personal foul. Fourth team foul. Shooting for the away So the first one drops, Davidson. and that will put them up by nine. Shots. He's off on the free throw, unable to get that second one to drop in. Yeah, you'd like to convert them all, but that should still be enough to secure the win. Two free throws coming up, and they call the shooting foul. Austin, second personal foul, fourth team foul. First free throw is good, and that brings them within eight. Goga Bitadze is checked in for Kansas City. Two shots. And so he makes both from the line. 32 seconds left to play here in the fourth. Pass to Austin. Here's Okiki. And the officials will call the illegal screen right there. And guys, point of emphasis for the league is to really crack down on illegal screens. Yes, the last few years, the rules changes have tended to benefit the offenses. This evens things out a bit. Minnesota calls timeout. They're trailing by seven. 17 seconds left in the game. What's your take, guys? And I don't think they'll be able to climb out of this hole. I just think they have to focus on the moment. Don't worry about the score. Worry about executing the next play. Rivers passes to Moore. Now here's Rivers from deep three-point range. Out of bounds. Out of Kansas bounds. City takes possession. The ball goes to the away team.
So it's the Knights winning this one. A narrow win under game. difficult circumstances, Greg, as the visiting team. It really was, but that didn't seem to bother. I mean,